Hello friends, now we will see the pulse amplitude modulation. Basically, the input to this pulse amplitude modulator, it is continuous modulating signal which is changing with respect to time. It is coupled to the low pass filter where the lower frequency components are allowed to pass and the higher frequency components are blocked. Then it is coupled to the multiplier. The multiplier it is operated with the pulse strain generator where the carrier pulses are applied to this and as per the modulating signal the amplitude of the carrier signal rather we can say that the carrier pulse amplitude will be changed as per the modulating signal and finally we will get the pm signal the detection of the pm signal it is very simple that is pm signal it is just applied to the low pass filter after the low pass filtering we can get the demodulated pm signal now we will see the waveform of this one now this is the information signal changes in accordance with the amplitude now here the carrier pulses are given so pulse carrier signal it is there now the pm signal the output of the carrier pulses will be changed according to the modulating signal and thus the pulse amplitude modulation is verified now this is all about the pm generation and the detection thank you for watching